Hi, this is a JavaScript tutorial example for the use of date and time. More specifically, as in getting the date and the time for today, or whenever you're watching this. So let's create our HTML file. Fastest of tools. <laughs> okay. So first of all, we need the HTML template. Why bother typing? And. Nothing fancy, we're just going to output the data to the screen. And we're going to write it straight in, inside the HTML file. And it's going to tick every second, so we're not going to use jQuery, we don't need it. And it's going to tick with a timer. So we can monitor every second. Let's set our timer. And that's milliseconds. So we need to get the date. First of all, that is as simple as new date. And that is not, can't simply just use that, as you will see. So we could string replace on this, but it's not the best way to do things. So let's do this a different way. So let's get the time. Let's get minutes. Let's get the seconds. And let's get the actual date. Yes, yeah, so that's misleading. Now, uh, month is from 0 to 11, so we always add one to get the actual 12. And year comes back in so that'll be 2016. And let's build a output. I like writing strings like this, it just makes things easier to read. Okay, so that's day slash month, U UK format, <laughs> yeah. And for the time. Hour, minute, 
seconds. And we want to attach it to our output. So document dot get element by ID. Uh, I think I called it output. Yes, I did. Um, let's take a look. So, 31st is the 8th, 2016. And there we go. We have our date output. Simple as that. Thank you for watching.